camel spins. Hope you guys are ready for this one. Let's start off by practicing our camel position at the wall. First, we are going to think about our belly button being parallel to the ice. While our belly button is parallel to the ice, our chest is up with a slight arch in our back. As our belly button is parallel to the ice, think about even the bottom of your nostrils being parallel to the ice too. We're here with a nice arch in our back. Pull our head up just a teeny bit, like someone having a little string pulling your head up. That's just gonna give you a notch more speed. For beginners, I like to think about keeping the arms parallel. If you're a little bit more advanced, feel free to be a little fancier with your arms. You can turn them out to the side. So at the wall, we want our leg to be at least parallel to the ice. I prefer if you have the flexibility to be a couple inches higher just to get that nice little soft arch. We're here, our toe is turned out. It's not here, but it's turned out to the side. My knee is completely locked and same with my skating knee. I think about my free hip stacking over my skating hip. My hip is facing down, just like my left hip. There are two stages to the camel spin. The first position, we're slightly bent. The entrance edge going to a camel spin is a slight three turn. So before we hit that three turn, we're going to be slightly bent. That's position one. Position two, we're going to walk up. We hit position two after we hit the three turn in our camel spin. Entering our spin. Position one, bent knee. Position two, walk. Now that we practiced both of those positions, let's get into the camel spin. When we enter the spin, I think same arm, same leg. Some coaches teach opposite arm, opposite leg, and others teach both arms together. But either way, choose what is most comfortable for you. Once we feel our free turn in our entrance, we're gonna pop up. As we pop up, our left arm should be back in our airplane position. Position one, pop up. Position two, the arm travels back. Another camel spin exercise is to do a backward spiral. Focus on stacking your right hip over the skating hip, finding that nice camel spin position and keeping your arms parallel to the ice. Get some speed going backwards. You can also do this going forwards to make it a little easier. Let's put it all together and try a camel spin. For our camel spin, start here and do a big push. Left arm over the left leg. To get a little bit more speed, we can also think about pulling our head up ever so slightly, slightly looking up at the ceiling to kick up the speed a notch. The first common mistake is dropping your shoulder. If you enter the camel spin, you should be keeping your shoulders level. If you enter like this, you will lose your balance from the beginning. Another common mistake is kicking your leg up too high, which will also make you lose your balance. Another common mistake is rushing the three turn entrance. So make sure you feel that three turn on position one, then rise up. If you rise up too soon, you will not get your maximum potential spin. You can also do the camel spin from an inside three turn entrance, but be sure to check your arm back before entering. like, subscribe, and see, and see you guys next time.